Well done, everybody, and thank you for those creative entries. Now, one of those crafts um, is going to be announced shortly as a winner, and the person who won gets to choose who faces the Minute to Win It challenge. So just to remind us of how the challenges work, let's pop back to last week when Nick chose Alison to face the Malteser Catch Challenge. OK, so I've decided to do the challenge where my partner, husband, throws Maltesers at me and I try and catch them in my mouth. I can't remember what the record on this is last time it happened, but who cares, because it's chocolate, so I'm going to try really hard. Good. Ready. Oh, yep. Three, time a minute. two, one. Yeah, two. <laughs> They're not melting quick enough. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> How am I doing for time? Halfway. Oh! Mm, yes! Oh! oh. <laughs> Stop. Six. Six. <laughs> Thanks for all the chocolate, Nick. <laughs> so that was rather a lot of fun, wasn't it? It seems that Alison was rather enjoying the uh, the chocolate. And I wonder how difficult it was to clear up the patio from any melting Maltesers after the event. So thinking about what we've just seen in the montage, uh, the winner this week, well, it's another adult. It's Pete for his amazing depiction of challenges with worship reminders to help overcome them on the way. And now we approach our time of prayer and confession, where we come before God and we ask him to forgive anything we've done wrong or things we've messed up this week. So let's turn to him in prayer, still our hearts and minds and settle to pray. Dear Lord, we thank you that you are with us all the time and all through the week. You see our successes and you see our failures and you love us just the same. We are sorry for the things we mess up and the things we could have done better and we ask for forgiveness, Lord, for all of those things. We thank you that Jesus sacrificed everything for us. And we thank you that you always welcome us and that you're always there and forgive us when we ask. Thank you, Lord Jesus. Amen. Amen. So now it's time for our first worship song, which is Sing and Shout by Matt Redman. So enjoy the worship. And then after the song, Stephen is going to read for us the story of Timothy and Paul from 2 Timothy chapter 1. <laughs> 